Hello, what is up everybody, RL57 Gaming here, back with yet another Forza Horizon 5 video, and today we will be checking out the GMC Cyclone. Now, this is a not new to Forza car, but still a returning car from the previous season, or from this previous uh, Forza Horizon game, which is Forza Horizon 4, and now it has returned to Forza Horizon 5 in the autumn season of the festival playlist from the uh, upgrade hero series where you can get this now until uh, another six days i guess six or seven days uh, to go and you can get yourselves a gmc cyclone for 20 points in the autumn season now this car yeah it is like a returning car like i said just now it is actually from forza horizon 4 now this is not bad of a truck it is actually a pickup truck where it used to be popular back in Forza Horizon 4 and it is still popular today. That's why many people have been asking for it because they missed the old GMC Cyclone and now it's back in Forza Horizon 5 for people to enjoy. Now, yes, uh, the GMC Cyclone is an ultimate sleeper like I said in the thumbnail as this car or pickup truck is indeed a sleeper not gonna lie because it is really really fast now for a pickup truck like this it is beyond its uh, expertise that it's fast faster than ever because first of all it comes stock with all-wheel drive but you can swap it out to rear wheel drive if you want and the option of engines is pretty insane as it has more than seven engines so it actually has seven engines for you to engine swap. There are six, including not including the stock engine. So it does come originally with 200 horsepower, which is pretty slow, not gonna lie, it's quite slow. In the video, I am actually showing you uh, using 731 horsepower, which is slightly faster, but not as fast as the fastest engine as you can swap in a v8 twin turbo which makes nearly 1700 horsepower which is insane and you can actually swap it out to do 2000 horsepower which is insane for a pickup truck like this now i know what you're thinking it's even though it is a sleeper how is it that fast like i said this is a pickup truck it can engine swap to however you want and the other thing is that it's all-wheel drive so basically makes it faster by any margin so yes it is really really fast now uh, customization wise it's not too bad uh, other than the engine swaps if you go check out like their like visual or maybe like it's aero customization yeah it kind of sucks as you only get front arrow and just a tiny wing at the back which is um, pretty boring not gonna lie other than that you can swap it out to rear wheel drive if you want you can swap out the wheels and whatnot and um, basically you can do whatever you want this with this car customization in order of paint styles well sad thing is well they didn't give let us to paint the bottom half of the car which is the other parts of the car the black bits at the bottom of the car which is super duper sad considering that it could have looked better in any other color without the bottom half being black now it's fine to me it's pretty good not gonna lie it's not too bad i would say it's just like the bottom half is in black and the other uh, the top half can be changed into any color you want well it's not too bad it's okay i guess but maybe some people would really like the bottom half to be colored as well but other than that this truck seems very fast not not, not gonna lie i believe it can reach somewhere up to 200 miles per hour if you're uh using the fast tune which well i don't really hi highly recommend for you to get the fast tune but well why not up to you and another thing is you can actually 
uh, turbo swap it as well you can add turbos if you want and uh, basically make it faster so if you use the v8 twin turbo you can basically make it up to 252 miles per hour which is very very good considering that it's a pickup truck and like i said it is a sleeper so that's the reason why i call it that as this is an old pickup truck and another thing is it can reach up to 200 plus miles per hour which is very very good considering that it has more horsepower than it should be it's considering the fast and very very good corner wise not too bad considering it's all wheel drive it has a bit of grip i guess maybe you expect some understeer indeed it does have some understeer a lot actually uh from my video basically my uh gameplay and whatnot it does have understeer but maybe you can upgrade it to maybe more aero cornering i guess some sort something like that but other than that the truck's not so, not too bad actually it's very very good very minimalistic and quite an awesome sleeper i would say it's very very nice and uh basically it's very very powerful now like i said you can get it in the autumn i mean autumn season so for those who haven't got the amg black series that i done a review of last week you're not able to get it anymore as the season has ended and another thing is well it's nearly impossible for you to get it in the auction house unless if you snipe it very fast other than that i don't think so you can get that car this car though i think it might be available in the auction house as well for sale maybe so but yeah overall this is not too bad of a sleeper very very fast very cool indeed love the whole body of it next week we will be checking out the gmc typhoon so stay tuned for that and yeah there you go there's my review of the gmc uh, cyclone and once again thank you guys for watching see my other videos don't forget to leave a like and subscribe and i'll see you guys in the next one see you soon bye bye